welcome back to another YouTube video. I hope you're good, I hope you're well. Welcome, I'm very excited about today. It's to get ready with me. I'm actually going to the theatre today. She's a theatre queen. Because we're gonna go see Darren Brown and I am very excited. I actually bought these tickets like two years ago. It was 2019. It was supposed to be 2020 and then obviously cancelled and then it was 2021 and now it's this year. So finally we're actually going to see him. It's been a long time coming. So I thought we would just get ready because you guys seem to love these videos and I love filming them. If you're new here, please hit the subscribe please hit the subscribe button i'm just going to start with some skincare i've just literally gone across my face with this toner by lancome which is such a beautiful toner i can't say any of their stuff essentially it's all in french and i'm just going to go in with my Bio recipe watermelon dew drops which are just so nice so so nice and i've also been loving these new drops these are eye spy drops by bandai sands and it's brightening it has green coffee beans and vitamin c in and they're so glowy makes your under eye looks stunning I definitely put too much of that on as you can see because it came out quite a lot oh the rain that's thrown off my outfit choice i was gonna go like with like a skirt like a little black skirt and then a shirt like i've got a striped oversized shirt and then some sandals but clearly i can't do that now maybe i could i feel like it's still warm so maybe i could then i'm just going to go in with my Embrelease cream which i have been loving guys this is amazing it it reminds me of a leader but without it being too sticky and heavy it's a lot lighter than a leader i'm just going to go in with refi brow sculpt and i'm just brushing my brows in the opposite direction to like really coat them. Once you've coated them, then you can go back and like brush them into like the desired shape. So the last get ready with me, when was that? I think it was a holiday get ready with me, which feels like a lifetime ago, even though it actually wasn't that long ago. The good thing about get ready with me is that we can just have a little chat. And we were talking about the Instagram situation, which I'm still in the process of sorting. Well, I just don't want to say too much. We've still got a way to go. We are going to get it back. We are going to get it back. But obviously it's just gonna unfortunately take some time and it's not knowing how long that will take and that's the frustrating thing. I'm finding it really hard like at the moment because I'm obviously like still doing TikToks and like I literally post on TikTok every day. Like not a day that I miss on TikTok which is like amazing. And my TikTok's obviously doing really well and I'm so grateful for that. Obviously the whole Instagram thing is still massively playing on my mind because I work so hard for it. So yeah, I just, I don't know, I'm just really struggling. And I'm well, I'm in a better place than what I was. Like I have actually been like really low. It's like everything to me. And then for it to just go, is like really distressing. Cause then I'm like, what did I do wrong? Like, and I still don't know what I did wrong. I'm just gonna use my Avena spf because we always need spf and enjoying this one this is the hello sunday one but my only criticism is it says it's a mist it's definitely not a mist because it's it comes out like a spray you expect like a really light finely milled mist and it comes out like and you're literally shocked to your core right let's start on some makeup i'm gonna take the iconic radiance booster in the shade pearl glow and mix it with my beauty crop foundation this is the shade 5c this is the vitamin babe foundation and then i'm also forgetting that i haven't covered my blemishes i've got a new collection of spots that are on my chin that kind of looks like a rash it's really weird i don't know who invited them cover them with my lancome concealer which is the best concealer ever blend that in and then we're gonna go in with our foundation very exciting i've actually got my hands on the marshmallow soap sponge by coco cosmetics by chloe and honestly it is amazing i'm just spraying some of my fix plug on there just mixing those two little products together and you know me i'm not a beauty blender girl but this is literally something else it is so so good and it blends foundation like so so easily i actually haven't properly used that foundation before and it's going on really nicely because those blemishes are really intense i'm just going to go over with my <gasps> i did my toenails a second ago <laughs> i'm just rolling them along the floor and i've just got stuck to the carpet <laughs> obviously <laughs> i thought 
I'll do it you I? So yeah, I'm very fancy there and brown. We're going, to, like I said, to Wolverhampton. So we're actually going home because that's the kind of area that I'm from originally, as you can tell by the accent. Also, this is the, this is the collection Last Infection Hydrating Concealer. This is the shade Toffee and I've been loving it as my contour. You don't need as much as the other stuff, but it is honestly so, so good. I've had a few really good weekends and I haven't been able to share them with you or tell you. I used to vlog and please let me know if you want vlogging back because I personally only watch vlogs. Like I used to watch YouTube for makeup content, but now I only watch, literally I only watch vlogs. I used to do it when I first started my channel, but because I am still growing, I needed to kind of stick to a niche rather than like just do both if you want that please let me know because i really enjoy it like i absolutely love vlogging i'm just going to go in underneath my eyes with the revolution blush this is what i've been loving this is the shade dolly rose and it is so so nice we're just going to go over with concealer so yeah last weekend i went to see out and john and oh my gosh and how all these everyone's going to see harry styles which i would absolutely love do not get me wrong but Ellen John it just hits differently. Yeah, it just reminds me so much of growing up, so much of my dad. I bought that charm for her 30th birthday last year. It was literally the best weekend. It was in Liverpool, which was amazing because I love Liverpool. It's literally one of my favourite cities in the UK. I literally screamed and sang my heart out. So I'm just taking this on a Morally brush. But yeah, he was amazing. Like, he still got it. Like, my mum beforehand kept saying, like, what if he dies? And I'm like, Joe, can we not? Can we not manifest that, please? I was like, I was a bit apprehensive. I was like, is he going to be as good as what I think he's going to be? And he was. Girls and boys, he was better. He was better. Then I'm just going to go in with that blush again. I'm just going to pop it on my hand. Just press that on the high points of my face. It's currently ten past two. And the show is not till half seven. But we want to go for dinner before. And I'm waiting for Callum to finish work. So I'm getting ready now to be ready for about three also this is kimchi faux freckles and this it's so good I do have quite a lot of freckles on my nose but obviously foundation covers it up i really like this beauty crop foundation if you haven't tried beauty crop please make sure you do go and try it because it is amazing my only criticism is that it doesn't have a lid on it like it's just a squeezy thing i don't know if you can oh oh my gosh oh right okay so it has a turny thing and i didn't realize you can actually oh there's me not locking it you can lock them okay sorry beauty crop i take that back for eyes i'm just gonna go over my eyes using my collection concealer i've honestly been loving putting this all over my eyes it's just so nice and it just adds coverage as well i'm gonna just take for my for my little wings that i'm gonna do i'm gonna take the morphe palette that i always use and i'm gonna take this chocolate shade down here to just do a little bit of a wing literally take that angle brush and just follow my eyelid up and then for mascara i always get my questions about my mascara on tiktok the maybelline sky high mascara in waterproof but this is the important part i've said it before and i will keep saying it has to be the waterproof one like, look at my lashes so obviously it's my lash serum as well which you all need and i'm gonna really lightly put a tiniest bit of like a brighter concealer underneath my eyes give the tiniest bit that's the Too faced cloud one which is amazing then for my under eyes i'm thinking i'm gonna take my fenty one because i haven't taken it for a while just go really up close also is anyone else sick of people sharing harry styles posts like i go on my tiktok and my whole page is riddled with Harry Styles and I'm not mad at the people. No, I am mad at the people actually. I am mad at the people because I'm so jealous. <laughs> like I said, I know I saw Elton John and I'm very grateful for seeing Elton John, but Harry Styles, that man. I mean, I used to fancy him One Direction, but now he's just like, he is just. I've literally had his album on repeat for the last year it feels like and i can't work out which one my favorite favorite song is like originally we started with obviously music for a sushi restaurant it's a classic it's a crowd piece we moved on to late night talking or the personal fave now we're on satellite and i also love daydreaming Run around, give me something to dream about <laughs> okay that was too much i'm just gonna <laughs> how pigmented that is i'm just taking the iconic blush it's stunning but like i just forgot how pigmented it is it is 
the silk rose duo. Oh no. I'm going to take um, a couple of setting mists. So I'm going to firstly take my Beauty Crop. This is the Vitamin Babe bottle, but it's actually the Oshere one. And I'm also going to go in with the Milk Hydro Grip setting mist. Give me all of your love. Give me something to dream about. Then I need to sort out the mane that is my hair. And I don't really know what to do with it. I'm just spray it with my heat protect spray. Me go so fast to the restaurant. So the hair tool I use is this Babyliss. I don't know what it's called. I'm going to probably put it on the screen now if I'm a good YouTuber. I use it a lot in my get ready's. Let me show you. We got the skinny thing. So you do like this and then hold. Right, you can see what I mean, like so far. I mean, if it was wet, I'd get a lot more volume, but it's quite nice. Like you just get like a blow dry, but without the blow dry. Do you know what I mean? So now I've done that, I'm just gonna spritz it with this Batiste powered shampoo, just to give like a bit of bounce. Now for lip, I'm gonna take my Refi Lip Sculpt in the shade Rosewood, which is my favorite ever then i'm going to take one of my five lipsticks at the moment this is the it's lancome this is a shade le beza cream le, be, le beza this i can't say it and blend it out and then because we always need a gloss i'm just going to go in with the refi gloss right, i'm going to go get change i'm just ch going to chuck something on to traveling but i want to show it you so hold on i think we're ready i'm actually on time and someone's only just getting in the shower and i'm early and i feel like i've achieved a hell of a lot <laughs> let me show you how cute this outfit is look how cute that is i'm obsessed thank you so much for joining me on my get ready and i hope you loved it and i hope you enjoy the get readies let me know what videos you want to see next and i will obviously provide and yeah thank you so much for being in my life and being you i'll let you know how damn brown is <laughs> i might get up on the stage <laughs>